So, <clears throat> using distribution, I've got a negative 6b squared z times the inside of that parentheses. That's pretty bad, but z squared times a. And if I rearrange this, I've got a negative 6a b squared times z times z squared. Again, not everyone would do this step. I'm just rearranging it so it, well, looks kind of pretty, I guess. So I've got negative 6. The a doesn't have any other, well, a's to combine with. Neither does the b squared. But I have a z and then a z squared. So that gives me a total of three z's. Bring this up into parts. So the next way, uh, the next distribution, I've got the same thing, this negative 6b squared z, and I'm going to multiply it by b a z. So the negative 6 doesn't have anything else to multiply with. And if I rearrange this, I can put the a in the front. But I've also got a b squared and a b, and then a red z, and a purple one. So this would give me a negative 6, no other a's. I've got a b squared and a b to the power of 1, so that would give me 3 b's. And that's my exponent, the 3. And then I've also got the z's, and I've got two of those. And we do have to be careful with this. Sometimes they'll throw in some of these, and you'll find other like terms that we need to combine at this point. But looking at just these first two terms, we have a b to the power of 2 and this b to the power of 3, so automatically they're not like terms, even though the degrees are the same. All right? And then next, so I've got the same thing, negative 6b squared z times <clears throat> negative 3b. So rearranging these ones, I put that on the wrong line, dang it. Uh, whatever. Negative 6 times negative 3, b squared b, and a z. So negative 6 times negative 3 is a positive 18. I've got a b squared and b to the power of 1, so I've got three b's and just the one z. And that would conclude the simplification of this problem. That was that kind of turned out bad. Let's try it again. Oh, that's better. Yeah. Here we've got this b cubed and this b cubed, but this term doesn't have any a's either, though. So we have to look at each of the variables, not just one. And uh, even the z, right? The z, this z is to the power of one. This z is to the power of two. So they're different. <clears throat>